Bauchi stake in an effort to address the gaps in human resource and some challenges of service delivery in the health sector, which is partly caused by inadequate manpower. The Bauchi state government has adopted a tax shifting and tax sharing policy document for essential health services in the state. State Commissioner of Health, Dr. Samalia Dahua, while launching the document in Bauchi, says this is a strategy which will help the health sector to ensure rational distribution of tax among existing health workforce cadres and allow more allow for more um, specific stacks where appropriate from highly qualified health workers to health workers with shorter training and fewer qualifications. About his state correspondent, Awad Hassan has more details. The health sector in Bochi State, as it is in many parts of Nigeria, has been faced with a serious challenges of inadequate manpower. A development which partly contributed to the causes of maternal mortality due mainly to insufficient service delivery. Various measures have been taken by government to improve service delivery, among which include employing volunteer clinical service health providers, especially in the primary health facilities to fill in the gaps which is created by shortage of manpower. However, that is not enough to cater for the teeming population as there are a number of health facilities which require more. The Bauchi State Government, therefore, with the support of USAID Integrated Health Project, IHP, as well as other development partners, designed this tax shifting and tax sharing policy aimed at addressing the gaps of human resources in the health sector. This strategy promises to assist this health sector to ensure rational redistribution of tasks among existing health workforce cadres and allow for moving specific tasks where appropriate from highly qualified health workers to health workers with shorter training at fewer qualifications. In his remark, the Executive Chairman Bochi State Primary Healthcare Development Agency, Dr. Ruan Muhammad, says many health personnel retire on a daily basis, hence the need to fill in those gaps for improved service delivery. By next year, 70 of our people here, including the ones seated in here, is in June, July, and they are all retiring, 75 of them are retiring. And they are all skills that we are talking about, not unskilled. Now we have 1,335 primary health care centers in Bauchi. We have 648 staff in primary health care headquarters. And then we have 7,648 at the local government. But every day they are retiring. Our directors are the primary national. They are all retiring. How can we do? What can we do to fill up this gap? This thing is essential to have this tax shifting tax sharing policy. This policy, which is documented, will help in no small measures towards addressing maternal mortality in the state. I think this itself is a question. If you give it to healthcare worker, he knows exactly what he should do and what he should not do. It is important to appropriate to, or to appreciate that the task shifting and task sharing policy measures are short-term and temporary. Representatives of various institutions in the state have attended the launching of the document. Awal Hassan, Viewer TV News, Bochi.